Hi, everybody. Well, that's a good welcome. <laughs> I had a more interrupted sleep last night. Um, it's Sunday, November 21st. 21. <coughs> um, yeah, so I'm going to edit another video and if I feel tired, I'll go back to sleep. Alrighty. Hey. So when are you back to working for Skinny Mike? Since the cops decided to make the streets safe for strollers and yoga mats again, fuck you very much. What do we do? You're clearing the path to the yuppies by tearing down our neighborhood brick by brick. That's what. Hey, the money I earn by tearing this shithole down allows me to put 50 bucks on the Royals. Say thank you and shut the fuck up. That's lunch! Hey. Still slumming at home, huh? Hey, two more weeks. What was that shit you were telling me about with the doctor? Doctor? Fucking shrink stuff or whatever. What do you mean for Ian? Is he, is he okay? Yeah. He's fine. I'm just asking, man. What is it? It's a mental health assessment, but you're usually... That's how bad I am yet. But yeah, it's snowing out there, guys. 
I nap for two hours. That's what I needed. Again, it's the 21st of November, a Sunday. I don't know when he said he'd uh, drop off my 100. about you all the time. But I guess you freaking out. There's this thing on the top of my spine. I'm gonna use the camera to record it now. I feel so 
memutuskan perayaan ini. Our Lord has given all power in heaven and on earth. If all men, purchased by his precious gut blood, are by a new right subjected to his dominion, if this power embraces all people, it must be clear that not one of our faculties is exempt from his empire. He must reign in our minds, which would, we would, should assent with perfect submission and firm belief to reveal truths and to the doctrines of Christ. He must reign in our wills, which should obey the laws and precepts of God. He must reign in our hearts, which should spurn natural desires and love God above all things and cleave to him alone. He must David Goose, James and I had quite a strong debate. So tune in and find out James' lesson for me. He's going to tell me how to be happy in this life, the secret to life. For more information about today's episode, or if you'd like to be on the show or in the audience, go to drjoe.com. You can follow me on Twitter, or Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, uh, especially our Facebook group called Dr. Phil Fanatics. That's P-H-A-N, Fanatics. It's a great group where I pop in and you guys get to hear what's happening with the show or whatever. Um, 
before anybody else does. And don't forget to subscribe to my podcast, Still in the Blanks. I've got a series starting very soon. This afternoon. Okay. Mum really worries about being out with the girls alone. <laughs> that is not listening to you. He just thinks I don't do enough. Bottom line. I have tried. I know. A lot Excuse. Of things. That's a wake-up call, mate. Why am I going to play it? When I tell you, you can come inside. No! No, I can't! Any sense? Um, I'm not sure. I mean, that, that was a weird one because I never know when those stories, it's like, uh is this just like a partisan thing where you just right. want to like yell at the guy the craziest thing to me was the picture of them in the hospital bed yeah that's where i was like what like it's just like you didn't you weren't in a hospital maybe the 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 you know surrogate was but it wasn't but like the, they were in right. the hospital. i'm hoping that the statements that she just made are just coming from a place of of truly not knowing what she's talking about so let's fix that and i just want to note that this is probably inaccurate so surrogate Brady, here's a plan i have you uh plugged in because you're down to like six percent of battery life <coughs> um soon i'm gonna go to bed and if i wake up in the middle of the night and if i can't fall back to sleep i'm gonna take a shower Excuse me, and then go to sleep again, okay? Sorry if this is confusing. It does make sense to me. And um, I'm going to clean tomorrow. So I'm going to film tomorrow with the hyperlapse and all that stuff. And my dad is going to uh, give me my allowance. So, alrighty. Um, I'm going to turn my light off so that uh you can see clearly because when i do the hyperlapse you don't see this you see what i mean so <clears throat> all righty All right, um, <clears throat> I am going to get ready for bed, and again, if you hear uh, dialogue of uh, ghost stories or whatever, or somebody telling a story, I can't fall asleep until I hear a story on YouTube, so, yeah. Um, so, I'm going to get myself dressed, and again, if I wake up in the middle of the night, shower brush teeth and go back to sleep because tomorrow next video you'll be seeing me clean like a donkey crazy lady uh-huh if i need more sleep i can always nap like i do all righty died the neighborhood security guard knocked on our door on a sunday morning he told us an old man came to your house earlier knocked on your door for a half an hour and finally left. When I asked him what he wanted, he told me he needed to say goodbye to someone that he never had a chance to meet. We're all stunned. Had no idea who this old man was, or he was looking for. When the guard came in, he shouted, That's the old man! 
pointing at a picture of my grandfather, my entire family froze for a minute. It's not 100% sure if the guard was telling the truth, but I almost like believing that my granddad wanted to say goodbye to his newborn son. Yester pants me in front of the entire school during lunch, you see. Saggy pants were a fad at my school in 8th grade, and almost nobody wore their pants at their waist where it was supposed to be. Almost nobody, except me. I, on the other hand, knew what the frick a belt was, when that punk butt grabbed a handful of my Levi's in an attempt to yank them down. He ended up getting caught red-handed molesting another dude in front of the entire school. It made that entire crappy school year worth it. I started at a small NYC ad agency last summer. My first day I was met with a disastrous ad to fix. Upon arrival, I was met with...